Oh, freaking race boys, welcome back to another episode of THC for fucking my sack. Got fucking uh, Blake with us today. How you doing? Awesome. You know, doing awesome? Yeah, well, I'm glad to be in Inwood and not on the roads to Inwood. Oh, you quit that? It was a, just a Chinook just took over. You had to quit driving Inwood? Yeah, yeah, I got sucked off onto the side of the road, sucked off on the side of the road a couple times I on the way here. I love getting sucked off on the side of the road. When it's a whiteout and you're getting sucked off, it's perfect. Yeah. <laughs> it was it was all right, I when guess. When the light comes out, when yeah. you're getting sucked off, mm -hmm. I fucking love that guy. It took me two hours to get here because I was getting I sucked. I love that guy. <laughs> it Hello. took me... <laughs> Fuck seeks! Two hours to get here because I was getting sucked off so much, bud. That, was, that must have been awesome. That was so awesome. I made it, though. Oh, fucking great. Fucking great. I don't man. think the Chinook's going to pass, buddy. No, so, I think it's... Fuck, I think we got fucked over. Inwood is my home now. I'm not Inwood leaving. Inwood is my home now. Oh, dear. I wonder what's happening. Just had fucking loss of signal or something. On the microphonic device. <laughs> but, uh, fuck, I'm almost out of piece of ash. Remember that great big huge piece of ash that I had? Look at it. It's like a baby dink. Baby dink of hash. For fuck's sakes. You better fucking smoke it. Fuck it. Fucking smoke it. I've been using the fucking recycler. A big time! Oh, yeah, we're, I think we're losing battery. Yeah, we're losing battery and fucking shit's getting dicked and... Oh, well. If you can't hear us, I apologize. I apologize. In accordance, but, uh... In other words, I've been using the shit out of this little recycler. It's like a big gob of snot into it. So I'm gonna be cleaning that out tonight, for fuck's sakes. Big me for dawn. Build, eh, buddy? It's coming together. It looks awesome. Yeah, not too bad. that visiting you now uh, I got over a hundred subs on my YouTube stop it. yeah buddy it was I was like real excited when it happened you got like 100 subs yeah last time I checked 102 man that thing should fuck off anytime so it's pretty uh, here I'll trade you nice in your words, we got fucking a Vadili for fuck's sake. He says, fucking pod, bud, fucking, which would you rather? Drive a Dodge on the highway for an hour or be stuck in a room with a drunk and naked McBody for an hour? <laughs> <coughs> well, I could die driving a Dodge on the highway for an hour, and I would just punch the fuck out of McFoddy unless he put his pants on, so <coughs> I'd rather be in a, in a room with McFoddy for an hour. But he would have totally have pants on and there would be no fucking getting around that or he'd get punched out. So I apologize. I apologize. But, uh, yeah. I would never drive a Dodge unless it was in accordance, bud. Would you ever drive a Dodge? Big time, buddy. I got the Dodge Rampage in my driveway and I can't wait to get it on the road this spring. <laughs> Fuck, I almost choked on the fucking medicinal. You'll drive that one, right? Want to bring it out to Inwood? Holy fuck. Or maybe like into a wall or something? And it's like fucking Dodge, fucking... Fucking... Delete. Then would have the old Dodge Delete button. Okay. When we did Ricky Pliance's fucking exhaust and for do a big jump and then he just up and never did a big jump like Pug went some sort of fucking just full out goof and then fucking... And then... Yeah, so in would quit Dodge. Park down Dodge. where they uh, have the farm equipment and walk down Inwood Road to get here. Want to yep. bring the Dodge? Yep. <coughs> I think I can handle that. 
Unless you want to ramp it. You can ramp your rampage, eh? That's why they called it that, bud. Mm. That's why they called it that, dude. Gordon's. Yeah. This. Sure, man. But we got fucking Rex. He says, fucking just now I cheached a dab of the le fucking laboratory's lemon diesel slash G13 that tasted like smoking Le Mans. Friggin' awesome. Here, beg my part for that. Choo choo, Rex. Holy shit, bud. That must have been some terpy fucking noids, eh? Some lemon terpy noids. noids. Terpy fucking lemon noids. <laughs> Holy shit. Did you gaunt it? <coughs> I tasted like a toilet puck. <coughs> they smell good. They probably don't taste good, though. Did you ever take a bite of one? A couple times. Yeah, they're chalky, eh? Holy shit. I'm gonna be dead. What just happened to myself? Shit yourself? Holy fuck. A little bit. Oh, did you see Red Band's movie tonight? Yeah. You did? Mm-hmm. He's got he's got Pugwin's deck mom's torch. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, he did. Pugwin's deck mom torch. Well, oh, big, big fan of Red Band for fuck's sakes. I uh, is. But uh we got fucking Steve. Hopefully. <coughs> Holy shit. <coughs> Holy I don't fucking dig her. Anyway, it's fucking uh Hey Pug, thought you might like this story. It's a true story, not because anyone got hurt, just due to the fact of what was involved. One man was injured in front of Ultimate Ford on US Highway 62 West shortly afternoon Wednesday when the unidentified man driving a Dodge Ram truck was rear-ended by a F-150 driving by a 56-year-old mountain home resident John Mor G Morganson. <coughs> Holy fuck. <coughs> <coughs> the, in <coughs> the injured driver <coughs> was being prepared for transport to Baxter Regional Medical Center. Mountain Home Police on scene said the identity would have to be determined at the hospital. The man did not appear to have life-threatening injuries and complained of a neck uh, complained of neck pain with no other visible injury. So Ford hit a Dodge. That's the story. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what's the story. Ford hit a Dodge, buddy. Dodge is a piece of shit, right? Maybe the story's fucking the mountain home police were on the scene. Police sticks? Maybe that's the story, bud. Maybe. Did you ever thought of it? Maybe there's like a story within a story, like a subplot. Yeah, but did you thought of it? I thought it. How are you doing? It's pretty awesome. <laughs> Holy fuck, I am dicked right now. My fucking appliance is just pulsating. But uh, we got fucking uh, Amputato. <coughs> and uh, hope you have a great THC show so far, Puck. I just downloaded your throwback album, and I love it. I can't stop singing Robotic Twainus. Oh, have you heard Robotic Twainus? I am your Twainus, eh? Robotic Twainus. I think I heard it once. How is your Twainus? <laughs> fucking uh... I also downloaded a couple albums from actual professional musicians, but I don't give a crap about them. I want to listen to the throwback again. Great job, buddy. Choo choo. Oh, fuck yeah. Fucking, fucking junk star. Fucking was able to cigarette butt it onto the for fuck's sake, sir. In accordance to now, you can fucking buy this shit on Google Play and different things. And you can get fucking free application, One Pug Life application. And then fucking, fucking updates coming soon for that. In accordance. Then you got a fucking, you know, 99 cents. 99 cents. No ads, fuck all, this and that. You don't like it, you don't have to have it, but, you know, if you do. <coughs> I got okay. it. Okay. Got like, uh, uh, like a few hundred, few hundred cigarettes right off the bat. Like That's fucking, sick. like 250 cigarette butts of for fuck Sackner. So probably close to like, you know, 375, 400 dicks. Fucking got the actual application. I like that kind, big time. Mm. Hey, you? Good? 
could have been fucking. Ex- you got an update about the, uh, the iPhone on? soon, eh? Yeah, whenever Junkster can find him in it. He has a full time job and fucking a house here, but lives there and roof and camper and this and that. And, you know, he's got his busy. own shit too. He busy. can't just be fucking making full time, full time Pug One apps. Right. I just, I quit. I quit being Merca. I just do Pug One apps full time. Eh? Quit Merca. Sounds like a good decision. Well, fuck yeah. That's what. Full time apps. Fucking okay. my part, but. I know it's boys. I'm fucking chazzled. Uh, big, big thanks to Junkstar for uh, doing all the fucking dirty work on getting the fucking program on the Google Play, and he's working on the iPhone sticker button, but in accordance to fucking, you know, fees and bullshit and stuff, plus it's a whole new cigarette. It's not like you can just say, oh, well, here it is in, in Stovepipe. you got to make a whole new app because right. it's, it's different. It's not yeah. the same, right? Yeah. So he's got to do it. Quit work. Yeah. You know what I mean? So fucking, yeah. Big, big thanks to Junkstar. Still a pipe. And where it's fucking, uh, that's going to have to be a cigarette. So there you go. Another medicinal episode. So until tomorrow, keep her medicated.